In this video, I'll show you how to screen mirror your iPhone to your Mac. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. Here's my Mac and here's my phone. And let's get straight into showing you how you can go and mirror your phone to your Mac. So the first thing you need to do is actually go and get a cable. And this cable is just a standard USB to lightning cable or whatever connector your phone has. So as you can see, here's one end, it's just a lightning cable which plugs into my phone. And on the other end, it's a USB cable. As you can see, I've actually got a USB-C adapter on it so I can go and plug it into my computer. So now let's go and plug this in. As you can see, one end is now plugged into my computer and I'm now gonna plug the other end into my phone just like you would uh, plug in when you're charging your phone, just like so. Then what you need to do is just go and unlock your phone like this. And on my Mac, I've actually had a pop-up just saying, do you want to allow this accessory to connect? Just click allow like so. And then I've had this pop-up on my phone saying, do you trust this computer? You'll need to trust it in order to go and do this. Then I'll need to go and enter my passcode. So I've now gone and enter my passcode. And now what we need to do is actually go onto our Mac. And what you need to do is go to the top and click on the magnification glass like so, and you to spotlight search. Now what we need to do is go and search something called QuickTime, Q-U-I-C-K, and then time. As you can see, it's actually already detected it. And then what you want to do is just click enter like that. Then you're gonna go and get this sort of thing pop up, but don't worry, what we need to do is actually go to the bottom and go and find QuickTime toolbar. Then what you need to do is click on it with two fingers. So we get this list of options here. Then what we need to do is go and press on new movie recording, just like this, and it will take a moment to load. And as you can see, it's now saying use phone as a webcam. But for that, you can go and press on remind me later. And now here I am. But now what we need to do is go and tap on this downwards arrow just to the right of this record button, tap there. Then as you can see, it's going giving us this section here called devices. And what you need to do is go and click on what your phone's called. So in this case, my phone is called Guide Realm. So I'll tap on it like so. And as you can see, it's now saying, allow the accessory to connect, press allow like so, and make sure your phone is on. And that's literally it. As you can see, we're now going and streaming our phone to our computer live, and it's really smooth as well. There's a little bit of lag at the stop. And if you want to go and record things as well, you can. All you need to do is go and press on this record button uh, in the middle of QuickTime like so, and then we'll be recording what our phone does, and you can go and stop it, and then you can go and watch it back. It's super easy. 